So uh, why don't you play one, Liam, before Willie gets? Uh, in? I was gonna pass it to Willie, but if uh, right. do you want it? But do you want to do that before? I, I can. Okay. I need to go. I think I'm, to I'm just gonna boot this game preemptively. I need. For you. Oh, I can't. Ta- well, okay. You're gonna throw him right into his. Right into that. Or, or do you want to play something else? I mean, I was, I wanted to, to try and penetrate the impenetrable. Oh, if you, if you want, you can. But I, I thought it play would be fun. Like, I will tell you for sure. It's good. It's be a struggle. we, we're not gonna then do we'll as. Save, then we'll do that. We, yeah, we're not gonna do as much as we would want to in summer lesson. I did try it just to be sure, and it's, uh, it takes some. So you know how to. So was, uh, you, this is for that, and then on the bottom here, yeah. there's a button that moves this forward and back on a rail. Okay. So Give me the do that first. Now. Yeah, here, grab it yourself. Like grab it like over the top. So you See, the the real challenge, folks. Wooly's head is very big. My head is big, and I have big hair. Yeah. Big hair, big head, big boy. <laughs> He's so, quite luxurious. Very big boy. It's gonna be a little bit rough, like like. Already, this kind of fits like a crown more than it like. Fits yeah, I wouldn't pull too much harder on that. No, 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 it's at the max. I can feel it at the max. Now the button down here. It's on the right hand side. That's uh, yeah. starboard. Yeah. Now starboard. and then you'll be able to slide it on a rail okay. no, towards. I'm good. I'm good. You're good. I can see. You don't have light penetrating I from don't the bottom. Have li- uh, I have light penetrating from the top, but like, there we go. Just get it right so that all looks clear to you. Uh, yeah. Here are your headphones. Thank you. Um, there is a volume meter here attached to the thing. Okay. The, the bottom two, like the one that has a big bump on it, is the volume up, and the one below that is volume down. Okay, I saw where I can't hear anything right now. Cause yeah, of, of course. Uh, and here's your controller, and you can hold options to recenter uh, at any time. Oh, God. So I, I would recommend recentering. Uh, okay, feel just, centered to me, but let's see. Yeah, uh, options rather, not the, not the home button. All right. Okay. So it's by this company called Monstars, which shut up. They must have known. I don't believe you. So, Willie, you like Res? I love Res. You love Res. Res is one of the best. You like Res a little, a lot. One of the best video games ever made. It is one of the best video games ever made. That is a hundred percent true. The spiritual uh, sequel to Hatred. Oh, I, I think, I think I would throw this in the pile with Zoe 2 as one of the least underrated so, games of all time. Someone has pointed out that Wooly is now the predator for real. Yeah. I am here. I have arrived. You're in res now. <sighs> I have to say, Wooly and I, I'm really cynical about stuff, and Wooly and I are about as far uh, on the low end of the spectrum of appreciability for this. Uh, and the fact that I really enjoyed it and I felt it means a lot. And I don't feel sick. I feel intimidated and tired. Yeah, I know. But I know. Fuck. You gotta, you gotta play. Damn it. Not yet. Okay. I'll play for over an hour. Yeah, they let you have it if you, uh... Okay. They're just like... But for now, you gotta what play... TV mode? I guess it's just to, um... Yeah, that's... You don't want that. No. No. So just that turn it into the one screen? That, that, that's like the cinema mode? Yeah. If you would rather play Res in cinema mode? If it's mode. too hard for you. Don't you don't need to if, oh, you know, know, X is the Well, button, you know how to way. play Res. Uh, in, in the 360 version, you could use the triggers, and this one, it's X. Okay. So... VR uh, style. It picks standard. Dynamic... More dynamic movement. I, I have no idea oh, what no. dynamic is, but I played it in standard, so. Okay. Oh, wait, what's a missile on this? X. Missile. Okay, never mind, it's fine. He'll figure it out. So you can look around and you can experience synesthesia. Yeah. And to us, it looks like. And you're you just can use your head. To, <laughs> yeah, it if does. You, you can use your head to target if you don't touch the stick. Oh shit! <laughs> That's how I'm playing now, baby. dude. This is like <laughs> That's it. That's this is it. the no. best version of Red. One hand. That's it. No head to do it. After I played it like this at PSX, I was like, I never need another copy of Res. Throw it all in the trash. Oh boy. <sighs> Wooly, you're gonna get your. Uh... Your pre-order after this, I see, assume. See, Wooly has a different de- <laughs> definition of a give-up machine. Yeah. yeah. See, me and, w- me and Liam want to go to the VR future. Yeah. Uh, with the MMO future. Matt wants to go to the creepy porn sex future, and that's fine. Uh, but Wooly wants to go to the fucking weird-ass wireframe techno future. Put me inside the music. Hide me there. Put the music <laughs> in my veins. Oh, and he's bouncing his head to the... Oh, boy. Oh boy. Dude, Pat, like, you don't even know. This, like, <laughs> after I played it at PSX, I was like, no, that's. 
It's throw all other versions of res in the trash. Hey, Wooly. Yeah. PlayStation VR launch bundle still available, but with prime <laughs> shipping. Yeah. So also, this has the trans vibration support. <laughs> so you can just cover your body in dual shocks. <laughs> oh, Wooly's positivity is He's infectious. really feeling it. Well, Wooly's the test, right? Because Wooly yeah. is a known sufferer of motion sickness, yeah. particularly with unnatural 3D space movement, yeah, right? Yeah. Oh, so okay. it all shows up. I, I was doing the same thing when I was playing it. Oh, yeah, no, dude, the, you're turning the video compression that we're going to use into <laughs> into dog shit. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's going to be like, why do you like this game? This it looks like ass. Amazing. What, like, this may be unwatchable for those at home. Oh yeah, the missile button, right? It's one of the shoulders, I think, but you don't need it. So <laughs> it's so good. So when is when is the the guys? This is the hard sell. This is the hard sell. Because I'm just because I'm just thinking because like. Wooly, back when we had our, our 360s hooked up all the time, right? Like, every week, there'd be like, well, just gotta go find out the fear is the mind killer. Guess I should play Res again. Right? But now, it's like... Like, you can make jokes about, like, how games get ported to the future and shit. <laughs> this is actually the way God intended to do Dude, it, it feels like Res was made for this. This is what he wanted. It, it's amazing, yeah. There's okay, no yeah. Time. No, so Wooly's not motion sick. He is... Totally killing the stream watchers. <laughs> you are making people sick. Good, that's fine. Good. That's the feel of Get watching there. people play. Get in there, fam. <laughs> this is a weird alternate reaction that I did not expect. <laughs> This is what Miz always wanted. This is it, dude, if you, this is the dream he had. If you read the interviews about it, this is like he's literally saying, this is right. it. This and is the, the best the yet. That he released was like a compromise. It was over a decade ahead of its time. I like, convinced him that it was like, we can't do better right now. Yeah, yeah. Wait 15 years, asshole. And Miz is like, like, I guess, I guess we'll put a vibrator in the box for now. That'll have to do. Yeah. Shits. You fucking shitty programmer. Always, always <laughs> great to get another reason to invalidate the Dreamcast. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, Rez Rez, I feel like London Heist is pretty cool and Scavenger was really, yeah. really cool. But I feel like something like Rez that is it, it transcends itself because of yeah. the VR is like I think I feel like Res is like a bigger I, killer app than all the well, other ones. Res is the highest rated title by far. I think it has 91 on Metacritic. I think that's completely unshocking in every way. Res has deserved higher scores than it's gotten for its entire lifetime. It's so easy. It's so easy. <laughs> I don't want the stick. Never, no, never touch the stick anymore. Like, like the moment you said that. <laughs> I, I had to let you use the stick for a second, just to... I'm almost upset. And, and Wooly, I had something very similar in, um, in Scavenger, where, like, for fine movements, like, the head tracking just kills anything else. And, like, for large turning movements, as long as I'm in a robot, mm -hmm. the right analog stick feels perfect. He knows. You're getting closer to Pepsi Man form. Or you're there oh, right Pepsi now. Man form's far away. He's at Area 4. It is 4, okay, Ooh, yeah. That's really close. Yeah. That's really close. It's a really nice camera shot. Oh, he's really feeling it. He's really feeling it right now. Oh, get those missiles. We got him. Don't he forget knows. that shit. He knows. That's way over there. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. It's really different, isn't it? That's why I was saying sit at the end of the couch so that you have room. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna need some room. So we're selling PSVRs with this stream. Dude, Res is incredible. Like, yeah. 
Wooly is in the zone. Wooly is I'm so really deep. feeling it. He is feeling it so good right Blue now. Blue scabbard guy with the dead on point. Hacking! Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, readjust that headset. It, yeah. it can't handle it. See, that's the thing, Willie. You, you saw that I had an imprint, but you want it tight. You don't want it loose. Yeah. No, no. With, with anything that makes you move like with a lazy RPG, yeah, you can go loose. Right? I worry for horror games, though, because. Like, I worry that you'll freak out and damage the device. You can do it, Wolves. You can do it. You can get the biggest, hottest score that You're, there ever was. You really know your way about this res thing. He's played this game quite a bit. He's played it quite a lot. Now, to be fair, I barely remember stages one, two, three, and four. Because you always want to play the last well, one. Well, I, I unlock the fifth one, and then I never play anything but the fifth one. Oh, like it's been, it, it has slightly tipped off your head? Yeah, it has actually. Okay, now I have fun. I got the controller, don't worry. Thank you, there we go. Analyze that, y'all. 100%. Uh, Wooly, if you need down. to make it a little tighter, you, there's Nine the dial at the back. Bullshit. What did I miss? I missed two minutes. One, one enemy or bullshit. something. That's Wooly, that's the best game of res you've ever played. <laughs> it's actually nice. But yeah, if you need to tighten it, you can use the dial at yeah. the back of yeah. your head. Oh. So... Right, this is the best version of Res, yeah. and every other version can fuck off into yeah. the garbage bin. Give me one more, guys. Yeah, go oh, for yeah, it. yo, go for it. Go for it. Go for Area 2, motherfucker. Do it. I actually think you'll appreciate Area X more when you play the other shit first. Oh, yeah, because you've seen it, right? Oh, yeah, a little bit. Apparently, we have some kind of mic crackle. Cool. That's great. We have some kind of audio popping. All of our mics are popping, apparently. Great. Good, good, good. I'll back off from my own mic then. Maybe that'll help a little bit. Guys, unfortunately, Wooly is the only one who knows how to fix this. He is... <laughs> he is experiencing he is, synesthesia right now. He is experiencing synesthesia right now. He is somewhat uh, inactive oh, at the fine. state. Yeah. Uh, we will fix the audio crackle as soon as Wooly comes out of his fever dream. I don't, I don't know why audio crackles. Crackles. Yeah. So no, the, the shower's right over there. Give me a minute to put the phones down. Now, Wooly, you're gonna have a- I'm telling you right now, okay? You seem to have the same thing that I have. When you take the headset off, you're going to be disoriented. Yeah, well, he's still got eight layers left, <laughs> what so... What do you mean, take the headset off? <laughs> that's good, I that's don't good. understand. And Wooly never left the couch ever again. Yeah, and the joke was always that me and Liam would get lost in the, in the cyber reality. Yeah, well... Right? And res, that- Res like, Res. I never thought that he would take to it this hard. Well, you weren't there when we were at the Game Grunts and he put on the vibe and he's like, I never want to take this off. Yeah. I remember you mentioned that. When can we play a DJ Z made uh, version of Melee yeah. in VR? <laughs> what is the live in the VR? Ganon is just him. Yeah. It's nuts. I'm eager to see what kind of trash this gets spit out when we render the video. Yeah, this is gonna get fucking compressed to hell. Because at the YouTube. same, because at the same time, like it's it's relatively solid colors. Yeah. But the camera shifting is so intense yeah. all the time that like you're gonna get macro blocking on this no matter how high the quality is. It's gonna be awesome. I've never, we're never gonna see a video get ruined so hard by YouTube. The the Shadow Warrior one video and the fucking what video was that? The sh the the game that was black and white, Matt. It was all black and white. Um. Betrayer, betrayal, the, betrayer, or, or something. White, white Those two videos, like, absolutely shot the bed. Like, yeah, YouTube, YouTube doesn't know how to deal good. with them. Yeah. So, like, Pat, one of the other things I really liked a lot, and you might have noticed it playing Scavengers Odyssey, is like these games are running at like a fake 90 or 120 FPS. Uh, they're they're running, and it feels incredible. They're they're running smooth. at. 
fake 90 or fake 120. Yeah. And the reason why it's fake is because they're actually only running at 60 or 90. Yeah. But the interpolation tech is fixing it so that you don't get horribly sick. And it works fucking good. And it, like, yeah, Sony's Sony's little breakout box that they have for that is actually a really fantastic yeah, idea. Yeah, yeah. Because it lets them get away with more on less power because it's a baked-in box. Um, but as a result, like, VR is a place in which I will never have to worry about frame rates. Yeah, right? it, 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 I'm kind of shocked at how stable everything that, is that we that, that there is finally a genre or place where it's just assumed yeah, that the frame rate will be really high. Performance is 100% a necessity. Yeah. And, like, the resolution of the, of the screens is such that, like, that is, like, a secondary concern. Yeah. Because it can only go so high. Yeah. Dolby Fire says, but the human eye can only see up to 32.5 FPS. That's right. <laughs> that's correct. That, that's right. Yeah, yeah. It's not that it's... Yes. I just need to be in more. Sir, well, Sir Hengareth says... Let me says, keep turning it up, then. All please the way. tear Wooly out of the machine before we all throw up and die. Wooly's, up. Wooly's volume is maxed out. Wooly is evolving. He's I turning want him into to just, a, like, lift off out of his seat. Wooly is truly <laughs> turning <laughs> digital. The roof. He has gone beyond it and is becoming sound. He's gonna come out of this hard. No, I think he's done already. I don't want to hear anyone ever again. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for us to show up for the podcast and it's like, where's Wooly? <laughs> and, and you go over to his place and he's dead. He's in, dead in the, in the, in the VR <laughs> machine and his dick is out. <laughs> He calls it his climax fever. And it's just written in semen on the ceiling, I'm done. <laughs> That's awful. That's real awful, yeah. I know. Give up machines are awesome. <laughs> These transitions are amazing in VR. This has nothing to do with anything, but PS3 support has been dropped for Final Fantasy XIV. Final Fantasy XIV. Yeah. As of the day of the next expansion. Yeah, That's a lot of people were saying you should be paying attention to FFUs or something. Uh, the the, the yeah, expansion yeah. live stream is happening <laughs> right now, but our live stream is more important because I can, important. I can just go home and watch the, the, the Cliff's notes of that later. Yeah. But fuck you, PS3 players. You're shit. I remember this part being hard. Not anymore. Do you remember that, Wooly? Fucking trivia. This is nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking nothing. A aiming, like, unconstrained from the stick, it it matters so much. Well, this is bringing mouse movement to consoles. Yeah, yeah, basically. It's like it's like how the Wii uh, mode trivial yeah trivialized, trivialized RE4. Absolutely. RE4's terrible archaic control scheme. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best way to play. No, but like it was the best way to play it too was. much. Yeah, it was it, too good. It broke the game. <laughs> I remember Professional having a really hard time on the original version, and like when I played Professional in fucking Wii version, I was like, "Is this even harder? I can't even tell." Yeah. Oh, well, he's becoming the weird sentient orb. Yeah, he's been it for a little while now. Oh yeah, yeah. a being, a true being of synesthesia. I can't wait to see his face when he comes out of this. Stream moments. Just... Here it comes. Oh my god, this is so easy. <laughs> yeah. Like I remember these fights relatively well. And I thought I, I thought I I thought I didn't, but I do. Yeah. 
And like, I remember this being like a pretty tough bot. Because you, you gotta use a stick that has like a really static um, movement speed. So and Wooly this, can just like, make it go as fast as his body can tolerate. Where do you want to aim? Well, there. I want to aim there. Actually, this opens up potential for like the the mecha variant of pushing pushing the, the the suit beyond its limits yeah because the limiter is your own body movement yeah and it's like i want high speed robot action yeah well can you take it yeah i want high speed robot action that the difficulty level is like just like mario kart cc's hmm. right and it's like at, at 150 cc's it makes like, and you get to have that moment where you're turning around the cockpit where, like, Bacchina, like, where is he? Yeah, yeah. Yes, no, it was called uh, Steel Battalion yeah. Heavy Arm. I know, yeah. I know, Matt. Just remember. He if as you, soon as he starts up with that tone, I know he's going to say Steel Battalion Heavy if Arm. If you look at Heavy Armor, like, if you watch a video armor. of it, you realize that, like, it's actually perfectly tailored to a VR conversion, like, immediately. Because the hands become one-to-one -one movement all of a sudden, not the, like, connect with a bit of latency uh, movement. Okay. Now... 100%. 100%. <laughs> this is the only way. Is, 100%. The there you go. There you go. 100% on your second attempt That's with this stuff. new control method. How can you argue with it as a control method? You can't. So, Wooly, we're going to pull you out of the res machine. Well, my favorite, my favorite thing about PSVR is that most of the games are like, here's a controller. A controller you know backwards and forwards. Yeah. Not these weird dildos. And the weird dildos are okay. But, but yeah, it's a minority of games that use those as the primary. Yeah, for those sure. weird dildos. I'd say anything that that you're shooting usually yeah. with a gun. Like yeah, exactly. Thing. London Heights supports All right. just using a controller. Now, Wooly. I'm gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna pull you out of the VR machine. You're, you're, you're safe. Take off your headphones Take first. Take off your head headphones. The headphones first. And hand them to me. Yeah. I'm, I'm to your... Okay. And pull your pull the visor away from your face first. And yeah. then the back one. Okay. And then, then the back. Now, come right out of it now. <laughs> yeah, see? Isn't that... No, isn't that weird? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little bit. A little bit. Don't you feel like you just teleported? So, uh... <laughs> About this res machine, <laughs> which will henceforth be known as a res machine. That's right. There's nothing else that matters. Make sure to you speak in one of these. In VR. Oh, God, yeah, no, I can imagine. But, uh... How you feeling? Guys. I, Guys. How you feeling? Gentlemen, res just came out. Look res, at me. Look the, at me. A, Guys. New, a new res platform just... That's, really. that's the cell. That's the cell. You know what? Oh, do man. it. The game right there. If you game. care about res that's, at all. That's, that's good ideas. Fucking do it. I'm glad I brought that up. I'm doing it right now. You're doing it on your phone right now? Where's my phone? <laughs> it's probably in your pocket, bro. Oh, man. Yeah, okay. And you know what? That fit on my head, too. I was a bit Which, concerned. you know what? Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, uh, like, uh, I had to, like, it, it, the blurriness it was because it shifted by about a millimeter. Yeah. Or two, uh, and that's because I was bobbing my head like a fucking And, Wooly, you're going to you're gonna want to do in the yeah. future, because you had some of your dreads on the inside of it. You're going to want to just flip yeah, those on, on the... Yeah, your dreads over it all. Yeah. Like, if you ponytail them all up... That doesn't work. No, I tried. No. I tried ponytailing. No, I mean your interior dreads. Like, the ones right next to your eye, eye line. Yeah. If you add a couple of those on the inside, oh, so you could... You could yeah, bit. yeah, you could easily flip those over. Okay. But, uh, I have a giant head. Well, he has a giant Ooh. head and hair, and both of us are as bad as skeptical of bizarre 3D movement as you can get, and I'm sold. I'm it, super sold. VR is cool. It's crazy that Res works as well as it does, considering <laughs> you're following an extremely high moving camera. And it's a retrofit. Yeah. Uh, usually, like, you have to kind of tailor make games or else they feel weird. I've seen a lot of good stuff about this expansion. That, but, that, uh, <laughs> that control method, though, it's, is. There's, like, literal game changer. They, yeah. They didn't tell me about it. Not ironically using the term. They didn't tell me about it at PSX when I sat down. And after, like, after the first two phases, I was like, oh, oh, when I touch the stick, it, it, it started, Moves. the stick takes over, so I should yeah. stop touching Just, the stick. Yeah. And then I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Look at it, it's targeted. Oh. So, Willie, you're going to want to check out our mic uh, yeah. crackling. That's what I'm doing right now. Um, 